Hi everybody, it's Ramona and I am here with three project shares for Alina Cuddle's store on AliExpress. Um, I do have to say as I'm getting started because I will forget to mention it, um, I placed a huge order with them yesterday. They are having their mid-year sale. So that's usually when I load up like on all my paper flowers and um, yeah, I bought a lot of dyes. Dyes I probably shouldn't have, but I'm playing planning on doing a mini album so I wanted to go ahead on and uh, load up on some of the dies that they had that look like really lacy and stuff so anyway let's go ahead and get started on all three of these I used um, this stamp die here I used the largest one on the outside and that one measures five by four and three quarters and then your smallest one will measure two and two and a half by, gosh, sometimes it's kind of hard to tell here, guys, uh, by about two inches. Okay, so I used that one on all three of them, and I love how they turned out. Um, let's go ahead and start with the middle um, card here. I just finished it and the hot glue is probably still drying as we speak. But um, yeah, so I went ahead and did this 3D bird cage. There are one, two, three, four, five, six different layers on this card. That's how I love popping stuff up um, on dimensionals. I made this bow here. Um, you can search my do tutorial that'll show you how to do that with two fingers. You don't have to buy any um, any um, kind of like bow maker or anything like that. And actually, to me, they turn out better. I like the look of them much better. So on this one, I did use some Michael's Little Flowers that I purchased years ago. I just ran into those in the garage a little while ago, and I'm like, hmm, I think I can use those. And um, I also used this um, leaf trim from Alina's store. And this is it right here. Okay, so I used that to run it down the side. I thought that kind of went pretty good with uh, the little birds there. And um, if you guys are interested, I also received this from Alina. I love this box right here because it gives you room to put things on the bottom. Okay, so that's the first card. The second card, let's do the let's do the Tour de France <laughs> right now. Um, Let's see, I went ahead and again popped this up, not quite so much. This is on one, two, three, four, five. This is on five different sheets that I went ahead and lifted that up off of the page. Um, I actually got this trim right here from, this is Dollar Tree's trim. Okay, you can buy it in a package and uh, you just rip them off of the, the little strips or whatever and it gives you... Oh, I'd say they're probably a good uh, six inches. No, I'll take it back. Maybe about four inches long. Four and a half, four inches long. Uh, so I got those for a dollar. Again, made my own bow here. And I thought that turned out super cute. Yeah? Okay. And then the last one that I have here is this teacup. This is the one uh, that I just finished. I was like, God, I hope that's dry because I went ahead. Um, I got this trim off of AliExpress. Um, the uh, pearl trim here is from Michaels. And then I popped it up on one, two, three. Yeah, four, four different sheets there. Okay. So anyway, guys, I thought that turned out, those turned out really cute. I really had fun making these. Um, I hope you kind of try stepping out of your comfort zone because um, I've been doing that a lot lately with um, a lot of the cards that I've been making. Um, you know, I was kind of stuck in one rut and um, AliExpress has actually kind of pushed me out of my comfort zone a little bit on making cards. So, um, yeah, guys, I hope you'd enjoyed this and hop on over to Alina's store and take a look at what she has. Touch you later, guys. Bye-bye.